the MPC decided by a majority of 5 members out of 6 to increase the policy repo rate by 35 basis points to 6.25 percent with immediate effect. Now I think this is one occasion where the market expectations and the decisions of the monetary policy committee are by and large aligned and there are several interpretations whether when the market expectation and the monetary policy decisions are aligned whether they are you know they have to be taken as a perfect monetary policy or otherwise but that debate can happen some other time. Now consequent to this increase in the policy repo rate by 35 basis points the standing deposit facility that is the SDF rate stands adjusted to 6 percent and the marginal standing facility rate and the bank rate to 6.5 percent. The MPC also decided by a majority of 4 out of 6 members to remain focused on withdrawal of accommodation to ensure that inflation remains within the target going forward while supporting growth. Let me now elaborate on the MPC's rationale behind these decisions, uh, these decisions relating to the policy rate and the stance of the monetary policy. Growth prospects across the world are dampening. Financial markets remain nervous and are characterized by high volatility and price swings. For the Indian economy, the outlook is supported by good progress of rubby sowing, sustained urban demand, improving rural demand, a pickup in manufacturing, rebound in services and robust credit expansion. Consumer price inflation moderated to 6.8 percent year on year in October as expected, but still it remains above the upper tolerance band of the target. Core inflation is exhibiting stickiness, while headline inflation may ease throughout through the rest of the year and in first quarter of 22, 20, first quarter of 2023-24, uh, it is expected to rule above the target. The medium term inflation outlook is exposed to heightened uncertainties from geopolitical tensions, financial market volatility and the rising incidence of weather related disruptions. On balance, the MPC was of the view that further calibrated monetary policy action is warranted to keep inflation expectations anchored, break core inflation persistence and contain second round effects. I would read this sentence again. The MPC was of the view that further calibrated monetary policy is warranted to keep number one inflation expectations anchored, number two break core inflation persistence and number three contain second round effects. These actions will strengthen the medium term growth prospects of the Indian economy. Accordingly, the MPC decided to increase the policy repo rate as I have said by 35 basis points to 6.25 percent and to remain focused on withdrawal of accommodation while supporting growth. Video pasand aaya, to hume like, comment, share aur subscribe zarur karein.